This is Judy's Lady Fernandez reporting for Miami Today. Ever walked into a cruise ship and felt like you were stepping into a whole different world? Well, if you did, that world might have been created by Joe Farkas. He's a longtime cruise ship architect. He has designed many of Carnival Cruise Line's fleet. With 30 years of experience, he has been the mastermind behind about 40 of Carnival's floating resorts. He sat with us and discussed his creative process and where he finds the inspiration to come up with so many different ideas. And he even shared some details about some of the ships he's designing right now. Here's what he had to share. Well, my, when I graduated uh, university, of course, I went to work in an architect's office, Morris Lapidus Associates, and worked there for about nine or ten years doing the normal stuff. Uh, some, uh, a couple of uh, my uh, building that I did there that, that I'm most pleased with was originally built as uh, Citizens Federal at 999 Brickell. It's now, I think, I think it's changed hands a few times. Last time I remember was the Spirit of Santo Bank. And it's still there, and I think it's still a very uh, relatable building. About uh, 1975, I met Ted Arison, who uh, founded Carnival Cruise Lines and began doing some work uh, for him when I was working with Morris Lapidus during the recession of the 70s and uh, got to know him well and uh, when they uh, when Carnival bought their third ship uh, which was going to be their biggest venture of all up to that point I uh, made a pitch to Ted and uh, asked him to let me do that ship and uh, for one reason or another he did and uh, and I have been doing uh, carnival ships uh, ever since uh, for the last, uh, you know, over 30 years now. Fortunately, when I got involved, nobody knew much about cruise ships, including, cruise, uh, including shipyards. So, uh, in a way, we were forced to uh, really write the book. And, uh, and we did. And, uh, and, you know, took Carnival Cruise Lines as the former uh, president uh, Bob Dickinson used to say the bottom of the bottom feeders and made it into the powerhouse corporation that is today that owns all these other brands besides Carnival Cruise Lines. 